Now for the rankings. This week, we have decided to rank college football uniforms. I like it. I like it. It's right, such now, a good one because everybody has their own opinion. Oh, everyone right? has their own opinion. So I, if you haven't seen this before, by the way, we do it in a draft format. Correct. So we each have 10, and and we draft it out. And Chris, I believe you start this week. I'm going to start this week, and I'm and, and I'm going to take two teams. I'm going to cheat, and we can make them either one, or they can be one, two, in any order you want. But I don't know that this is negotiable. I don't know that I'm willing to budge on either of these. And this is not patriotic bull crap that we're just throwing out there. The Army-Navy uniforms for the last couple of years when they play each other are unbelievable. They, they, have, they have done things so unique with the helmets and with the jerseys and everything that it's one of the things that got me more excited for that game than I used to. And I wouldn't know who to put one and who to put two, but, but those – I think we start the list with those two. I'll tell you who to put one. Going to put Navy one. Okay. That Navy's alternate from last year with the anchor logo, the old school numbers, all that. Fantastic. Yeah. So they uh, put the ships on the helmet. Yeah. And then and then the, but Army did the same thing. They were putting like battle tanks and different stuff on the helmet. I just thought it was pretty unbelievable. That that's my one and two. We're gonna do my my one will be the Army Navy. Yeah, game. you you can you can Alternate count both uniforms. of them. There we go. You can you can do both of them. All right. Uh, number two, my uh, my number one, but number two on this list, I'm gonna go with Penn State. Okay. I love Penn State's uniform. It is, and I'm I'm just a traditional. I think our our I think our uniforms are gonna be way different. There might not be any on my ten that you have. And there might not be any on your 10 that I have. It's entirely possible. It's entirely possible. Look, Penn State is my number two. Okay. I just, I like the all white or the all white with the, with the navy Navy's, blue. Yep. Um, I'm a big fan of that. It's just, it's so clean. It's so cool looking. And especially in the middle of a whiteout, like the Ohio State this game or Ohio State game this year is going to be unreal. Yeah. So yeah. it's so Penn State, the white uniform or really? white helmet. That's me, number two. So I'm going to take a traditional school for number three. Okay. But not the traditional uniform. The Notre Dame green clover unis are just okay. incredible I get, to me. I can get down with that. I love when they come out and they break out the green unis. Now, they don't have a great record in the green unis. But when they break <laughs> out the green unis, I get excited. And it's one of the few times, if I know they're wearing them, I got money on Notre Dame that day. Okay. I, okay. I'm liking that game. All right, so we got number one, Army-Navy, number two, Penn State, number three, Notre Dame, green unis. Yep. Who you got? Number four, traditionalist, I'm going Alabama number four. All right. Alabama, the in, in the home jersey more so than the away jersey. It, the crimson jersey, the crimson helmet with the white lettering, like it is about as, as college football as you can get, right? It's just, You see that, and it just – it oozes college football yeah i love it and that's fine i mean it's your school when i get that my problem with some of the traditional uniforms especially the alabama crimson and the ohio state crimson and the oklahoma crimson is just like you know you don't know who if they took the name off the jersey and they all stood three of them next to each other nobody would be able to tell who's who okay i'm with you and 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 so that's just my and that that is not the alabama hate it's just it's not you. Penn State it's not is unique. different because it's white and navy, and nobody else really has that. That's yeah. that big of a boy. Next pick for me, the Ole Miss Powder Blues. Now I have a. I heart. had that on my list. I have. Oh, I can't believe that. Yeah. I I have a love for the Powder Blues. I think my favorite uniform in in the NFL is also the Charger Powder Blue. I don't know what it is. I really like that color. Have you, have you got North Carolina on there? <laughs> they're, with, they're, the, with their baby blues? They're at the bottom. Okay. Yes, they, they, they made my list. So, But the <laughs> Ole Miss Powder Blues, I'm a big, big fan of. Okay. All right. So the Ole Miss Powder Blue is your number five, right? Yeah, that's our number five. All right. So number six for me is, uh, let's see, where am I? Oh, LSU. Oh, I love it. Look now. Do you like the purple or do you like no, the traditional white? I like the in, traditional in white at the helmet with the uh, with the tiger and the. Or, I mean, it's yeah. Like everything about that, it's traditionalist. It's but it it's 
it's very unique. You know no, whose is, helmet it that is. It is different. That's right. So, I, I love LSU. LSU is number six for me. I wish that LSU did more with the Tiger Eye logo. The center, the 50-yard line logo that's just a Tiger Eye. Yeah, that, that'd be fun. I wish they did more. Almost all the LSU paraphernalia that I own has that logo on it. And it's kind of hard to find. Yeah. My next pick, which would number be seven. our number seven, I've only seen worn once. At Halloween, see, when I, when I pick this stuff, man, I'm not just picking the uniforms they wear all the time. A couple of years back, Tennessee played a big Halloween game. 2009 against South Carolina. South Carolina. And they came out with some black unis with that orange. That orange looks awesome with that black uniform. I was super pumped. Not a Tennessee fan growing up. Didn't like them. So the Tennessee Halloween but, black. That was Lane Kiffin's year. That, yeah, it was Lane Kiffin's year. And that whole stadium was black and orange. And I immediately thought, Every year, some school for Halloween should be playing on Halloween. I don't care if it falls on a Monday, Tuesday, Sunday. I don't care. <laughs> Halloween, two schools need to play. They need to schedule it. And Nike, Under Armour, Adidas, whoever's got the contract, needs to make the home team a black uni. Back in like the Virginia day. Virginia Tech with the orange. Auburn with the orange. Back in the day, Florida LSU the orange, and Ole Miss like. used to always play on the week of Halloween. That was their rivalry week. Yeah. And I wish that we would go back to that schedule. And I wish the home team would get the black uni because they're both sponsored by Nike. Nike says home team gets the black uni. I think the black with the red would look amazing. Oh, I yeah, think the would. black with the purple would look amazing. Or the or with the I just think it's it's black funny are that pretty, you pretty it, awesome. It's funny that you bring that up. the The UT Halloween black is number seven. Uh, number eight for me is actually Washington's all black uniforms with the oh, purple lettering. Yeah. Yeah, okay. And so I didn't even I, think of that. I love that it it's look, they got the black pants, black jersey, black helmet with that purple W That's on right. it and and little on the white, black jersey. The white outline because yep. purple and black are hard to see, but, but, when but you, you got outline, an outline on when it. You outline it with white, it pops, man. It's same thing with the uh same thing with the numbers. Yep. And it, I don't think it's I don't think it's white. I think it's like a light gold. Yeah, or something. Yeah, because it's other gold color. Gold and purple. That's right. But yeah, it's uh, so number number eight is Washington's all black uniforms with the purple lettering. All right, number nine for me. I'm gonna go a little off course here. I'm gonna go with the recent newish Memphis Tennessee whites. Are you Memphis talking about the tiger. one with the uh, the nine hundred one on the on the helmet? No, I like the, the, I like the the white stripe. helmet with the tiger stripes. Okay, and the all white uniforms with a little blue trim, just a little blue trim and blue numbers. I really like the Memphis Whites. I, I do like that. I'm a, I'm a big, big fan of those. All right, number 10. This may seem a little weird. Okay. I like TCU's all purple uniforms. TCU's on my list, too. They, they've I'm got the horned fan. frog on yeah. the helmet, and it is it just pops. Because that color purple, for whatever reason, pops on the screen. Especially on HDs now, right? I mean, it's it's crazy. But... Yeah, that's it. to round out the top ten. TCU's all purple uniform is awesome. Looking. So, so you know, so you know, I'm a big TCU fan. I like them. I root for them in the Big Twelve all the time. I, I, and it's a lot of it. Hey, you're, you're a Gary Patterson fan. I'm a, a lot of it is Gary Patterson. Can we agree that the Horn Frog is one of the coolest mascots of all time? <laughs> like mascots in the SEC are a thing Wait, right now because Ole Miss is going through their thing with the Land the Shark. shark. And it's Tony like, the Land yeah. Shark. But but how I will tell you this. My team is a tiger, and tigers are cool, but like they're kind of like uh, we can't think very of very unique. Let's be a tiger. Yeah, there's, there's a no, bunch. Of there's Auburn tigers. The horn frog has to be yeah. my favorite. If you said what's your favorite college mascot, I think it's TCU's horn frog. It, it doesn't get much better than a horn frog when it's on the side of that helmet. That's a cool looking logo. Man. I I agree with you. So, I agree with you. Sweet. All right. So you got uh, any, to, you got any uh, like runners up or that we, anything we didn't honorable mention? Yeah, um, that's it. That's what we call it. So them. I've got Virginia Tech, it just their normal uniform. I, I do like their traditional uniforms. Um, I got Michigan State. Uh, you you took my Ole Miss powder blue. Okay. Uh, Michigan State's traditional like green uniform because it, the green with the uh, the Spartan on the helmet and all that that that's awesome. And I'm not a fan of them, but that's Auburn. Yeah, like the the AU logo on that white helmet pops, and it, then the jersey itself yeah. with the Auburn across the chest. Like, if it's, you like it's traditional awesome. uniforms, the navy, orange, and white, the way they do it, it's very classic looking, clean looking. Yes. My runners up are what? What do we call that? Honorable, Honorable mention. So Man, I, 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 I would have if had we gone even further. USC's traditional uh, stuff. Yeah, I love that. 
Yeah. I love USC. So you can obviously tell. I'm just not a maroon guy. It's not It's not a color that I'm a fan of. Or a I can understand that. Oregon, all of them. <laughs> all of them. They've, they've never walked out in a uniform where I didn't say, man, that's awesome. Yeah. I would, if I had, like, blue chip talent, I would go and play at Oregon. I, I just yeah. would have just because I want all the gear. That I makes just, sense. That's it. That's all I want. And I wouldn't sell it. I don't care how broke I am. I'd just line my I'd wallpaper my house in it. Um, I like Boise State's uniforms a lot, um, especially I kind of like when they go white on the blue field. I think it looks cool with little yeah. orange trims. And then North Carolina. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I like the powder blue. North Carolina, when they do the Argyle with it, a little classic look. That's probably the most classic out of all of them. I think you're probably right. All right, here's the uh, the rundown. Uh, Army or Navy, whichever one you want to put number one, that's – that's it. We'll, we'll go on and mark both of them. Together. Number two, Penn State, classic white uniform. Uh, or the – what? either no, way, either Penn State uniform is good. Yeah, the, yeah, the white. All ones. white or the the navy jersey. Either one. Uh, Notre Dame, the green with the with the clover, like the four-leaf clover. That's right. Uh, Alabama's traditional crimson jersey uniform. Number five is the Ole Miss powder blue. Uh, number six, LSU's traditional uniform, uh, the white the uniform. White, yeah. Number seven, UT's Halloween black uniform from back in 2009. You'll probably never see it again. Yeah, but I don't know. Uh, but that shame, one time, man. it was cool. That's a shame, though, man. Uh, Washington's all black uniforms with the purple lettering was number eight. Number nine, the Memphis whites with the tiger stripe helmet. Number 10, TCU's all purple. That's I love one. it. That's all a right. good one. All right, that's going to wrap up the ranking.